911, what is the location of the emergency? Okay, what's going on, Evan? Do you need police fire medical? No, it's not a medical issue. We we have a missing child since this morning. We already called three times, and the police didn't show up yet. Are you listening? Or yes. Do you know? Okay. Yes. Yes, ma'am. I see right here for the. Uh, yes, ma'am. I see you. This is waiting for deputy to respond. They haven't. They haven't come here yet. I, I'm worried, ma'am. I see you. It's waiting for a deputy to respond. You're waiting for a deputy to respond. Yes, ma'am. And how long? What do we need to wait? It's, it's a child missing. I understand, ma'am, but I'm just not able to give an ETA. I, I'm, I don't know when they'll be there. So how long do we need to wait? This is an emergency. Ma'am, we, we have the information, but it just. It, they're trying to get there someone as soon as possible. So this is not important for you guys? Really? No, we're very busy in the area. Look, I understand that they'll be there as soon as they can, okay? Hmm. 911, what is the location of your emergency? Um, okay, police and medical. Hi, um, I called at the long ago reporting a missing child. I just wanted to know how long the cops are going to take to get here. Okay, hold on. Let me open up the call and let's see. The call is still currently pending to have the deputies respond out there, but we don't have any available deputies. We still have the call up, though, holding. Okay, so so no one's on their way yet? Not yet, no. Mm, does it take long for them to respond to the call? If there's a big emergency in the area um, and there's nobody, there's no units available, they put the calls on hold. But as soon as one becomes available, they respond to the next pressing call. Okay, yeah, uh, we just need one here urgently. So I understand. Um, we still have the call. We still have the call holding. Okay. Is yes. Yep. We still have the call holding for them. I'll go ahead and update them with the information. All right. Thank you. Because this happened yeah. very recently, so we just want to get everyone here. She's been missing since 8 a.m., so we want to get everything done as soon as possible to try to find her. I understand. Okay. Thank Hello. you. 911. What's the location of your emergency? Um. It's. And is there a specific apartment number, ma'am? Uh. It's. And do you need police, fire, or medical? Uh, police, possibly. I'm reporting a missing child. Okay. And what is the name of the business there, ma'am? The business? Um, okay. And the child that you're trying to report missing, are you calling on behalf of the of the parent? Yes, yes, on behalf of the mother. She's missing. Okay. Okay. And then so, and ma'am, how old is the child? She's... And could I go ahead and get her name? Yes. It's... And is she white, black, or Hispanic? She's white. Okay. Blonde and hair, dirty blonde hair, blue eyes. Okay, hold on with me here. And then what color shirt and pants was she last seen wearing? Um, hold on, let me ask. So, um, what color shirt and like what was she last wearing? Hold on, oh, we're finding out. Okay, and then how long has it been though since you guys have last seen her? Since this morning. She was dropped off um at school this morning and Apparently, she never showed up. We called um, everyone we knew. No one seen her. Okay. And then, so, ma'am, I just want to confirm, though, was she last seen from this address before oh. you guys last saw her? No, 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 no. Um, she was last seen at the church next to Honey Creek Middle School. I think it's called Peace Church. I'm not sure of the exact address. Uh, she was wearing a dark green hoodie, I believe. What is the name of the church? Uh, I think it's called, I'm pretty sure it's called Peace Church. It's the one right next to Honey Creek Middle School. It's the, well, no, no, no. It's, Got it. it's across the street school. from it? Um, I, I believe so, yeah. There's there's two. I forgot about the other one. It's not Focal Point Church. It's um, Well, is it Peace United Methodist Church? Yes, yes. Okay. That one. Okay, is she diagnosed with any medical mental conditions at all? Um, I know she takes medication for ADHD, and I think that I'm pretty sure that's it. Okay. Sorry, bear with me here. And is she known to carry anything on her person, like a pocket knife, a pepper spray, anything at all like no, that? No, okay. no, nothing like that. Does she have a cell phone that she might keep on her person? She doesn't. She had one when she left at home conveniently today. Okay. Okay. And ma'am, what is your name? My name is... All 
Okay, perfect, thank you. And just so we recognize you when we arrive there, though, at the advance to come meet with you guys. Are you, ma'am, white, black, Indian, Asian, or Hispanic? I'm Hispanic. And what color shirt and pants will you be wearing? Uh, pants, dark black jeans. Uh, I have a green cardigan on and a white shirt. Thank you. And I just need to verbally confirm as all. Do you have any at all weapons on your person? No, I do not. Okay. All right. And are you going to be waiting for us inside? Um. Yeah. Uh. I'll probably. I'll come outside. I still see you guys. I'll see when you guys show up. Okay. Perfect. Then. So then I'll get a call place for service. We'll have deputies out there to the to come and make a report with you and to come and assist with trying to find your. Okay. Okay. Her mother and my. Um. They're going to the school to double check and everything, but from what we know, she wasn't there, so they okay. should be back soon too because it's right next to the That's, school. Yeah, that's fine. So if, if at least one of you remains there, though, to meet with an officer, that's more than fine, okay? Yeah, I'll be, I'll be here. Okay, then. All right. Thank you so much, ma'am. And I'll go ahead and let you go. We'll be out there as quickly as we can, okay? Okay. All right. Bye-bye, ma'am. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.